We now go to China for a space exploration update. Chinese space engineers thrilled by breakthrough accuracy of Tianzhou 7 cargo spacecraft mission, while Turkey's first astronaut and three other crew members representing Europe were launched from Florida on a voyage to the International Space Station. The cargo spacecraft was launched to deliver supplies for its orbiting Tiangong space station, according to the China Manned Space Agency or CMSA. The Long March 7 W8 rocket carrying Tianzhou 7 blasted off F-22 at 27 Beijing time from the Wei Chang spacecraft launch site in the southern island province of Hainan, the CMSA said. Notably, the mission marked the first employment of the manual ignition to launch the Long March 7 rocket enhancing operational convenience by streamlining the launch process and relevant procedures. Meanwhile, a SpaceX crew Dragon capsule carrying the Axiom quartet lifted off about an hour before the sunset from NASA's Kennedy Space Center in Cape Canaveral, beginning a plan of 36-hour flight to the orbiting laboratory. Live video streamed online by Axiom showed the two-stage of 25-story tall launch vehicle streaking into partly cloudy skies over Florida's Atlantic coast atop of a fiery yellowish tail of exhaust. The rocket's reusable lower stage, having detached from the rest of the spacecraft, flew itself back to Earth and safely touched down on a landing zone near the launch site. Meantime, Astrobotics Peregrine Lunar Lander was recorded firing its thruster on its way to re-entry the above Australia. On January 9, the company announced the craft would fail to make a soft landing on the moon after springing off a propellant leak in the first few hours of its journey in space. The lander was launched successfully at 2.18 am ET on January 8 from Cape Canaveral, Florida but it suffered a propulsion system issue in route to the moon.